Hello, I'm Finn, and today we are doing a life hack that I have been wanting to do for years now. I couldn't previously because I didn't have an oven, but now I do. Today we're making pizza skulls. It's a pizza slash calzone that looks like a cranium. Just wait, you'll see. What you'll need is pizza dough, cheese, tomato sauce, and meat. Oh, and a pan. <laughs> At the grocery store when I was at self-checkout, the employee was asking me about baseball, which under normal circumstances never happens because I look a little... But I think because of my... My shoes... Oh. There we go. My shoes, he thought I was a butch masculine man who had knowledge of baseball. So I have to preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm such a good chef for remembering. I don't know about you, but opening these dough cans scared the shit out of me. Ooh, I'm so scared. Ah! Oh! Ooh. Ooh, she's sticky. Ugh, oh, I should call him. So I lubricated the pan, and then I just tried jamming the dough into the pan, which didn't work at all. It was awful. Here comes the fun part. So first I put a scoop of cheese, and then I put a scoop of tomato sauce, and then I shredded up about three pepperonis, put another scoop of tomato sauce, and then put a big ol' scoop of cheese on top, and then I closed up the dough. They all look so good so far, except for this one, which I'm very suspicious of. Look, it's like, ooh. Then I put them in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 25 minutes. Completely random, but I tried filming a Chia Pet Skull video last week, and I wanted it to be cute, I wanted it to be fun. Shut up, Alexa. Alexa, quiet. And this is the final result. Why is it so scary? I thought Chia Pets are supposed to be cute. Alright, moment of truth. Ooh, they are so hot still. <laughs> um, look at that, you guys. Oh my goodness. It's everything I wanted it to be. Gorgeous. Stunning. For whatever reason, they all look slightly different and they're kind of spooky in their own way. This one is way spookier than the others. So this one here was the one I was suspicious of, but it actually turned out the best. And this one was kind of a flop. For whatever reason, it was way softer than the others. You could film a slime video with it. Here's what they look like on the inside. They were mwah, chef's kiss. They were a little bit oily. I'd probably leave out the pepperoni next time, but they were so cheesy, so juicy, so delicious. I would say this was a huge success. Look how spooky these are. The melted cheese and sauce is an absolute nightmare on this one. Bye-bye.